Welcome to the video tutorial about Quinta Group Search Engine Optimization Tool for Plon, also known as Quinta Group SE Optimizer. This is a Plon add-on developed by Quinta Group team for enhancing search engine's visibility of Plon websites. In this screencast, I'll show you how to easily install this product on a Plon website and how to effectively use it. Quinta Group SE Optimizer is distributed as a Python app and can be downloaded from plon.org as well as from Python package index websites. If your project is based on Plon 3D2 above, you are likely to use build-out based of installation to manage it. Plon SEO product can be easily installed by adding lines to your build-out CFG file and rerunning the build-out. Let's begin to install this product. Go to your instance file system and open buildout cfg file. Add Quinta Group SE Optimizer to the list of X for installation. Besides, add two lines to the uh, ZCML specification area to make Plon Recipes of two instance install a ZCML slug for this product. So, add two lines which are Quinta Group SE Optimizer and uh, Quinta Group SE Optimizer overrides. Now save this file and go back to your instance. Now it's time to rerun the build out. You can do it with such a command in the terminal as bin slash build out minus nv. Press enter. Now your build out is rerunning and the new egg will be added to your instance. After that, you will have to restart the server process, for example, with such a command in the terminal as bin instance restart. Press enter and after Zoop restart is over, new product SC optimizer will become available for installation in Plone. Finally, log in to your website as administrator and go to Site Setup, Add on Products, and select Quinta Group SC Optimizer among products available for installation. Press Install. And here it is, our product was successfully installed. After installation, you'll see a new item appeared under Add-on Products Configuration, which is Search Engine Optimizer. So that was pretty easy and now let's have a look at what this product gives to us. Let's go to Search Engine Optimizer Configuration area. Here you can control if Dublin Core meta tags are exposed in the head of content pages. Besides, you can set default custom meta tags, which are meta tag names which will appear in SEO property tabs. Here you can also set additional keywords that should be added to the content types. Use this field when you want uh, that your content types receive additional keywords from the ones you manually specify. And uh, in the very bottom of this page, you can select which content types will have SEO properties enabled. Select uh, the one you want to have these properties and press save. Go to a document for which you want to define search engine optimization values and switch to SEO properties tab. 
In the open form you can edit HTML text that are automatically produced by Plon to increase search and invisibility. The fields that are on this page are the following. The first one is page title tag. This is a text to be displayed in browser title bar. Search engines displayed it as a title of the document. Then there is meta description tag, which is a description of the document to be displayed in um, um, search engine results uh, right um, below title. It is indexed and is considered to be more important than the page content by several search engines. Meta keywords tag. These are keywords of the page to, to, that it is indexed with. HTML command. These are commands embedded into HTML header. Robot tag. Uh, this is robot's meta tag value. Allows or denies identifying or following links for spiders that index your content. Distribution tag um, to designate time and area distribution of the document. Then there is a um, canonical URL. Uh, use this field if your site has identical or similar content that is accessible through multiple URLs. This field allows you to set one exact URL you want people to see. And besides, you can add custom meta tags. Um, the values generated by Plon are present as default values in input fields. To override default value, check corresponding override checkbox and uh, type in your new value. Let's for example change page title tag and um, description tag. Don't forget to check override checkbox. Let's also set some keywords to this page. And save the page when you are finished. You can do this for all pages that need enhanced SEO properties. Thank you for listening and come back to us next time.